and welcome back to gold rush rp so obviously in the last episode we ran into uh let's just say a couple issues uh over in mexico when we tried to do our little mission over there uh we did end up kind of on a decent note though by the end of it ended up kind of positively as we may now start supplying the mexicans with potential ammo in the future uh but we're not going to be too quick at that just because that situation was again a little little crazy so we're gonna try and stick away from them for maybe a little bit we might run into them today if we're getting real desperate but the goal for today is to finally sell off a decent amount of ammo and make our money back because currently we are sitting at about $300, a little bit under $300 in the bank. So we really need some money if we're going to be able to make anything interesting or if I'm going to do anything too interesting for you guys, we're going to have to have some money to be able to do it with. So that is going to be the main goal for today. Unfortunately, I don't think Frankie is still going to be around. We're going to try looking for him, even though we usually aren't able to find him. Uh, we're going to try and check all the people that we've sold to in the past. And the worst case, if we can't sell to anyone, is to go to the Mexicans. Uh, but we're going to have to be very, very cautious of how we do that and very careful as, of course, we don't want any situation like what happened in the last video happening once again. Uh, but we do still have around 45 boxes of high velocity, around 24 of the slugs, and around 12 of the high velocity repeater, which should be around seven, I'd say six, six, five to seven thousand dollars. Hopefully, if we can sell it all at the price that we want to. And then we'll be pretty damn well off. We can get a decent order and still have money left in the bank. We can, uh, of course, get our horse, our saddlebags, the bags, and everything we want with it and an actual saddle. Because again, I want to get this horse tricked out since this one's going to be with us for a long, long time. Uh, but to do a lot of the stuff that I have planned for the next couple days, we are going to have to have quite a bit of money. So uh, let's go around and see if we can find anyone who wants to buy ammo. We're going to, of course, first stop at the Strawberry Gunsmith. See if either Sinclair or Frankie is around. Although Although I doubt Frankie is. Let's see if maybe they want to buy something. Well, howdy. Good morning, Bill. Nice to go, Missy. But I'm uh, contemplating maybe saving up for a better horse. It's all right at the moment. Some other time, or just the cart because the cart is. You got a quick second? Sure. I got a little sword to tell you. No, I didn't. I ended up going down to Mexico. All right. Let's just say it didn't go well. All uh, right. So, but at this point, I'm desperate. I got $200. Uh. And I have like five, six thousand dollars worth of ammo. <laughs> so you should go check uh, New Moscow. Oh, yeah. I was supposed to set up a deal with them. I'm pretty sure. Are He's they uh, established yet? I, it has been in the works for a few weeks now, and they've been very, what is the term, uh, positive about it. So I assume that it is set up. Uh, Scar has been posting flyers of Roscoe being turned into oh. Moscow. Do you think they're up there right now? Potentially. All right. Well, I'm going to up there. The cause, yeah, they said, uh, or I was talking to Scar and he said we might be able to get someone to set up once uh, that stuff's going and running. Well, no, depending on the last time that you talked to him, it's probably best to check in then. Uh, well, it was two or three days ago, so it might be perfect time. Yeah. All right, I'll go check then, Dusty. That's villain. Travel nice safe. Seeing you as always. See you. Yep. Keep the balls warm. I'm gonna try to. All right. So we just had a little talk with Dusty, and he says that we should go check out New Moscow, which is all the way up near our little hunting ground up here. And apparently, uh, we had talked to Scar a couple days ago. I think it was three, four five days ago somewhere around then and he said once this place is up and running to go talk to him and we might be able to set up a deal because this would be the perfect spot to sell ammo out of since it's literally far away from pretty much anything the closest law is either in valentine or strawberry and that's a ways a ways away um so we're gonna head up to new moscow which is apparently is what it's getting called up here and uh see what we can find hopefully again hopefully uh scar is up there and there's some people up there and we can start talking to him about some deals and uh, I guess we will see how it goes. I'll see you guys once we're up in the cold area of New Moscow, as it has been recently named. And hopefully we're going to be able to set up some little trade relations with the new town. I will see you guys once we're up there. And we are over here. Now, it's either called New Roscoe or New Moscow. It's one of the two. I'm not too sure. But it does look like there's quite a couple of horses here. So we may be in for some good luck. Hitch up our horse and uh, see if Scar is around. Buff. Oh my. Oh, oh, are you talking yeah. buff? There yeah, are a lot nice. of people. 
<laughs> yeah, wow, they're supposed to be sweeping these for us. Hello. Uh, huh? Holy shit, there's a lot of people up here. If you got a second scar, not to bother you immediately, but. Did you drop my yeah, hand on the floor? All right. No, was, I, took, I put it somewhere over here. At the All right, we're gonna have a quick talk of Scar. Hopefully, set something up here. A lot of memories oh. here, Scar. I used to hunt up at Lake Isabella for hours and hours. Really? Oh, hey, that's how I made my first <laughs> money. Oh my god, yeah, it's a pretty beautiful hunting spot here. It's yeah. so nice up here. It's just glad to see people actually up here for once. It's real nice. Yeah, yeah. It didn't just, we didn't even open, brother. Hey, well, we don't have uh, even a recipe, the gramophone from poker, nothing, right? And there's always these people already up here. That's, that's real nice. Yeah, yeah. There were people up here, people came. I, there is one guy, the tour guy. He was at the, at the counter there, right? He mm -hmm. came for the storm. Just, you know, to well, save yeah. himself. And uh, after that, he didn't leave. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, <laughs> it's been two, three days now, yeah. It is a nice place, either way. It's nice yeah. and peaceful. When the storms aren't going on, it's nice. Um, but what I oh, wanted yeah, to talk definitely. to you about is mm -hmm. I believe we discussed uh, the ammo situation earlier, and you said once stuff's oh, yes. running up here, you might be interested. So I was wondering if there was uh, anything to go on with that. The thing is, I will connect you with the guy, right? Mm -hmm. I can't do anything myself. BBC. Because if uh, I get involved with anything, I do right? What? And I what get caught, the whole scared? place will come. Fuck out of here. Right? Wait, wait. So I will connect you with a guy that, that helps, right? That mm. is a part of the town, right? So you'll go through him. Okay, that's, okay. That's how we will do it. Okay, okay, okay. I'll Was let that... you know to find you. Where can you find you, actually? Uh, that's a little <laughs> hard. I'm kind of everywhere, but usually strawberry. Strawberry? Oh. Wait. The drama place, huh? Wait. <laughs> Although, I don't know. If this place is getting good, I might be moving up here. It's, it looks real nice. Yes. Do you know anyone else who would be interested, who is trustworthy enough to talk to about it? Brother, with this ammo thing, right? Mm -hmm. I love this stuff. It's unique, it's powerful, it can help you, right? A bit. It's, it takes advantage. But the thing is that the market is too, there's too much out there, right? Really, I was told there ain't enough, but obviously Brother, if I'm trying I... to sell them, <laughs> it's not the case. <laughs> I'm telling you, if I go, if I go to the Valentine, if I go to Strawberry, if I go, the second person I ask, he has the ammo. Really? I tried. Yeah, it's Man. it's too much. It's too much. I don't know. It's just uh, it's too spread out, right? I'm Every that. business that starts going good for me ends up going to shit every single <laughs> goddamn time. Every Ooh. single time. And but I've had this batch for over a week and a half. I haven't been able to sell it. Oh god! Is it a large batch? <laughs> it is. It is quite large. Ah, it seems like not it's, good luck so far. Bigger. It seems like everyone that we were originally supposed to sell for it already got it by someone else, and apparently yeah, the market's um, gone a little flooded, no which is not good. Um, All right, well, I don't know. I'm going to have to probably just... I don't even know where to go. <laughs> yeah, but uh, I'm going to try and, I think, just get rid of it all and then yes. see if I can get pre-orders. I'm not doing just buying bulk anymore because, obviously, supply yeah. since I last was selling has gone up quite a bit. Yeah, that's how you should it. But, yeah. you know... Oh, well, yeah, it looks like I'm heading to Mexico. Like, yeah. you, you wish me luck, Scar. It ain't probably gonna go well, but. Yeah, hey, I wish you luck, brother. And just be careful, right? I will, I will. Just get on the good side. I'm gonna people, try my best. Will help you. Yes, they will help you. But you need to help them first. Yep, yep, <laughs> That's yep. how it is. Show respect to get respect. Mm -hmm. Simple. Alright, well, I'm gonna go down there and hopefully I leave up both my testicles. Of course, brother. And if you ever plan on coming up here, maybe moving here, you're more than welcome, brother. I'll check the in place, here and there, uh, see how it's going. Of course, uh, there will be a grand opening very soon. Don't let, don't let For now, it's open. Wait, wait, hey, 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 hey. Please, Scar, please. No, 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 no. <laughs> I can't grab it. Is that He's chaos? Just playing. It is. Just playing. Oh, sorry. God, damn. <laughs> All right, Scar, I'll see you around. You take yeah, care. <laughs> Not seeing your cast as well. <laughs> All right, so it's looking like our only option is going to be the damn. Uh, it's going to be Mexico, but it's just so freaking risky. I'm out of cash. I'll see you soon, guys. Go ahead. Yeah. I'll see you, fella. <laughs> you take care. It looks like you're having fun up here. <laughs> yeah, I am. I am. Don't be a stranger. I will. I will. I'll be stopping here, here and there. Hello. I might need some special ammo. I might need that from you. Oh, you want to hop on real quick? Have a little talk. Bro. Okay, oh. never mind. All right, so, uh,. What are you interested in? Mostly probably, um, fucking, uh... Hopefully what it's the shells go for? Uh, the slugs? Let me do a double check just just to make sure. Uh, so the slugs are 90 a box. 
But again, if you 90. buy in bulk, I can bring that price quite a bit down. How many boxes you got? Uh, right now, I can check real quick. I think I have 24. So, uh, what were you interested in? Shit, probably like two boxes for now. You know, okay, I don't, get, okay. I don't really do too much of nothing crazy. You know I got I mean? you. Oh, is there anything you need? Uh, money. But besides that, I think I'm all right. <laughs> you got some on you right now? I do, I do. Shit, I was at 180. Yeah, do you have that money on you? I do. Oh, really? Okay, that makes I it easy care. for me. Yeah, yeah. All right, sweet. Well, at least we're going to get two boxes of ammo sold. Better than nothing. And then we'll probably be heading back to Blackwater. There you go. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. All righty. So at least we got uh, two boxes sold. It's better than selling nothing. Let's uh, head back down to probably Blackwater, uh, reconvene and get all set up there, and then head down to Mexico. And uh, hopefully that goes well. I guess we will see. But unfortunately, still bad luck with ammo. Apparently, the market's been getting flooded somehow. I'm not sure who's been flooding it. But apparently, it's been a little bit harder to sell. So hopefully, we can set up some sort of deal with the Mexicans. Guess we will see. Either way, I will see you in just a little bit. When again, we are getting all ready over in Blackwater. And we are over in Blackwater. Now, I was thinking on the way over here, uh, when we go to go to the border to talk to them about everything, we are not going to bring any of the ammo on us. We're just going to be as paranoid as we can, as, of course, we have no idea what's going to exactly happen. Uh, we're going to try and be as cautious as we can, especially with our last encounter with them. We want to definitely err on the side of caution. So uh, let's again quickly, I'll assume there's like a couple new buildings in Blackwater. Does seem a little weird on the frames, but uh, oh wow, oh wow. Okay, but never mind. This whole entire thing's new. Okay, that's why my frames feel a little weird. All of this is new. Okay, so I'm not sure if it's still getting constructed or what, but this whole entire thing is new. Let's actually. Hmm, are we gonna get distracted? Yeah, we're gonna get distracted. Let's check it out real quick. Let's also put our two hundred dollars away. That's probably a good idea. And then uh, let's go check out what these new buildings entail. All right, so let's check it out. It definitely hits the frames a little hard. So what is this? The big black water. Is there anything on the map? No, there is not. Just the courthouse. So what is this? Just as black water. And are these open yet? Or are these all locked? Oh, I'm guessing these are all locked. Okay, never mind. We'll check this out a different time. Uh, I'm going to guess most of these are just all works in progress. I think it's all still getting developed and constructed. But... Uh, again, let's drop off our nice weapons just in case and we're gonna be super cautious So let's drop off our good weapons. Let's grab out our shotgun again, and we're just gonna grab a stupid uh, cattleman Again, we should uh, be fine. I don't yeah, think we're gonna run bad. into any issues down there again I think after the last time and after giving them the ammo, they know we're legit and we're not gonna pull any weird stuff And I think we hopefully should be good but uh, let's see if we have any luck. I'll see you guys once we're at the border. Possibly setting up some ammo deals with the Mexican army. I will see you guys in a very short amount of time. And we are over at the border. Let's see if there's any on the other side. Hopefully they are here. So we're able to do some deals. Let's see. And I prefer to stay here near the border and not all the way inside at their fort. Let's see, I do see a horse over there. So that's a good sign. Oh, perfect. Oh, howdy. Hola. Como How's estas? it going? Ooh. You meet the guard this time. You're not running across. <laughs> no, sir. I was looking to uh, to talk to, I think, the fella I talked to yesterday. I forget what his name was, Um, but we were talking oh, about... Follow, follow me, follow yep, yep, yep. Me. You know what I'm talking about? I believe so. I okay. think he's here. I think he's the one you're after. Okay, okay. Capitan, where are you? I believe, uh, is he the one you spoke to? Howdy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Howdy. How are you doing? I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. Uh, I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about the uh, the business we uh, discussed yesterday. Mm. Yeah. That's all right. See? Uh, would you want to discuss in a certain spot or? We can discuss right here. These are all my amigos. Okay, okay, okay. Um, So I still do have quite a decent amount of uh, that ammo left over mm -hmm. if you were looking to get some of it. Yeah. And again, if mm. you do want to buy it in bulk, I can give you quite a discount on it. Well, how much you got left? I might buy it all. Uh, I have quite a lot. I don't think you'll be buying all this. Um, uh, I think the, I have the, the final lot of meal. Uh, forty-five high-velocity rifle, uh, twenty-two slugs, and twelve or fourteen of the uh, repeater. Okay, if I have to buy a whole lot, what was your best price? 
Oh, holy shit. I'm going to need a second on that one. G yeah, give yeah. me a second. Give me a second. Uh, can I hitch my horse over there if you don't mind? Of course. Right, I'll course. just be one second. That's, that's a lot of math. Oh, my. If they actually, if they buy everything we, oh, my God. That, that would be, that would be amazing. All right. So, let me do a lot of math real quick. And uh, I'll get back to you guys in just one second. All right. I have done the math and it comes out to 8,000. 780 but if they're gonna buy all of this we can give them a huge discount if they're gonna be buying all of it so uh let's see what they think Alrighty. so i have done the uh, mathematics mm -hmm. and it comes out uh to 8780 but if you're gonna buy all of it i could give you a mm -hmm. huge discount on that yeah just hold on I'm gonna yeah, take, your time. Take, this is. take your time take your time Oh boy, if they actually buy all this ammo, we are set for a long time. And we might not even reinvest in the ammo or just a small amount because it sounds like the market's flooded. So this would be perfect to get all of it off our hands. Okay, I help you. Let's just wait for them to deal with this border thing and then uh, hopefully yeah, we right. can do some business. Uh, right. okay. Uh, what's the best price you can do? Um, I mean, let me think. I could probably drop it down to 6,800. That's almost two grand off. That's about two grand off. Yeah. So what? Six, 6,800? Wait, yes, sir. All right. Okay. Yeah. You want to do it at a bank? Oh, uh, yeah. That that would be much preferred. Yeah. Okay. So you're we'll looking to grab to, all of it? Uh, yeah, yeah. All right. We will go. I don't really want to go to Amrita, though. We uh, can go anywhere you want. We can go Blackwater. Yeah. Let's, let's just do Blackwater. Um, okay. Right, perfect. Um, six thousand eight, right? Six thousand eight. Okay. All right. <laughs> Let's go. We're selling off all of our ammo in one go. This is perfect. Oh my, we're losing a little bit of money from not selling it all individually, but it did, uh, this is this makes it way more convenient for us. For also, I can come with you on the way back if you want extra protection. I know y'all are pretty pretty armed already, but uh, yeah, that's fine, amigo. That's fine. Uh, it's just right. yeah, I know it's a lot, so right. Okay, uh, I should have enough of my uh, bank anyway to get it covered all. So we'll get that. Holy shit, this guy's got a lot of money. Or what we'll do is we will meet you at Thieves Landing, we'll grab our wagon. Okay. Um, and then we will head to Blackwater together. Or if, if you want, we can just meet you at the bank. Well, right, that um, works. That works for me. Want me to meet yeah. you at the bank in Blackwater? I'll help you uh, transport it back though, just in yeah, case. Yeah, just because yeah. that's a lot of shit. So. Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, so give. It, it, we will like five minutes. Um, oh, yeah, I'll just meet you down we'll there. Take your time. Okay. No rush. Adios. All yep. right. See you soon, Phelan. Let's go. We're selling off all the ammo in one go. This is what we needed. Again, we're losing like 2,000 in profit. But again, we're already making a ton back in profit. So it doesn't really matter too much. Uh, and getting this all done in one go just for leaves hours and hours and hours and hours and hours. Maybe even days of us having to go and find people who actually want to buy ammo. So this is like, this is, this is, this is perfect. I'm very glad, even though we are very nervous to talk to them again, I'm very glad we did. And now the problem is if we actually want to get more ammo in the future, I'm not sure if it's going to be worth it just because apparently there has been quite a lot of ammo on the market recently but maybe we can get something going with the mexicans but uh either way you know we're getting it done we're making money that's what matters we're gonna have 60 almost we're gonna have over seven grand in our bank account after this deal which is gonna be the biggest come up we have had on the server yet i will meet you guys again when we're in blackwater at the bank hopefully this all goes smoothly all right let's get this deal done yeah i got free on yeah Right. All right. Yeah. Um, actually, it's uh, 66, not 68. I was oh. off two boxes. I only need a uh, hundred. Hundred? Yeah, it's hundred. Then I can give you back when I get the border. Two babies. Yeah. Do you mind if we do the money first, just because I'm alone here and you got yeah. ten million? Yeah, 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 okay, okay. Just if that, it just makes me more comfortable. If it's all. I just just before half. <coughs> quickly. Run me down on the prices for for your boxes. Yeah. Okay. So my calculations were correct. It's fine. Okay. okay. And again, I was off two boxes of repeater, so it's a uh, sixty-six, not sixty-eight. Six thousand six hundred. Yeah. Yes, sir. Fine. Okay. I'm gonna drop it on the ground for you, maybe. Okay. I'm all right. Here, Here we go. Baby, all right, there we go. Let's speed. put this in the bank right, right away. Are you here I whistle, you put your shit away. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All righty. Okay, you heard that, amigo. If you whistles, you put your shit back in your bank. Okay, got it. All right. Um, so it's gonna be a little weird transporting these because you can only hold a certain amount of kind of each. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, so just, okay. Uh, 
I'm gonna put some of the bank, so whichever I'll pick up what you drop, you know. Just oh, give me okay, a second, okay. I'll put some stuff in the bank. Wait, 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 just let me know. All right, we're gonna sell all the give him all this ammo. It's gonna take quite a hot minute or two, and then I'll catch back up with you guys in a second. All right, this should be the last five boxes. Let's double check. Yeah, we should be good. We should have gave him all of it. Literally all the ammo we had. This is this is this is amazing. Great way to end off the video as well. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it. But we're gonna still have to make it over into Mexico and help them. So it's not over yet. We're not clear yet. But we're almost there. 45, 22, 12. Yeah, we're good. All right, sorry. All okay, right, amigo. Uh, pleasure doing business with you. Wait, okay, I mean, I'll, I'll come with you guys on the way back. Just make sure yeah, everything yeah, goes yeah. smoothly. But of course, as always, as always, I'm glad that we could uh, turn the other day into something a little bit more positive. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna quickly grab my guns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be coming with y'all. All right, sweet. Let's help them transport it over, and uh, then we should be good. Our money should be in the bank. We should have all of our deals all done, and we should be uh, having quite a large amount of money. So hopefully, this will be a little uneventful journey. It most likely will be, but. I'll see you guys when either we are at the border going over or if we run into anything on the way. Again, hopefully this, this should just go smoothly. I don't think we'll run into any problems, but I guess we shall see. I'll either see you guys at the border or again, if we run into any issues, I'll see you when that happens. Alrighty. Here we are finally at the border. I think we should be pretty good. I'm just going to make sure they get across all right. And then they should probably be set from there. Y'all all set from here? Same here. Same here. Same here. Same here. Same here. Pleasure doing business, y'all. Okay, Mr. Seville, you be careful. All right, you as well. Y'all take care. Adios. Adios. Stay Bye, safe. Yeah. Okay. So, honestly, getting caught in Mexico was probably, in hindsight, one of the best things that could have happened to us now that we were able to do this huge deal with them. And now, again, we have freaking $7,000 in the bank. That means, uh, next video, we're going to finally get Moo the Fourth all tricked out. We're going to get her, of course, a super nice saddle, some nice bags, a nice little blanket, maybe even some more cosmetic stuff. Again, we got some money now. Uh, and of course, now that we have a bunch of money, we can start reinvesting in other things. Now, now, uh, the ammo, from what I've been seeing, seems very, very hard to sell unless we want to keep selling to the Mexicans, which is a possibility, but can always end up going wrong, as, of course, we have heard and seen, uh, both firsthand and from other people. So we're definitely going to have to keep our eyes out, think of ideas. I'm not too sure if we want to continue with the ammo business. It has made us some good money, but it's also caused us quite a lot of headaches. Um, so let me guys know what you guys think in the comment section as well as to what we should do now. We kind of have an open book. We can pretty much do whatever we want now that we have a ton of money to really fall back on uh we could start honestly trying to figure out to the uh the banks and the stores and more of the criminal stuff try to get our criminal skill up so we can do some of the uh super cool uh npc missions where you basically have to go raid a place uh, take out a bunch of npcs and take over a zone or something like that uh there's a bunch of those quests but of course we need a high skill cap in our criminal knowledge to be able to do it so we could focus on that because that is quite um from what i've heard to be able to get that up we can just spend a bunch of money on paying people for stuff or we can of course start hitting some banks and uh, more high risk stuff as well now that of course if we do get caught we have some money to fall back on either way let me know what you guys think we should now do in the comment section below as we now have a ton of money to allow us to do a lot of stuff and have a lot more freedom with a lot less stress and a lot less risk involved uh but either way hopefully you guys did enjoy this video and if you did as always make sure to leave a like and if you want to subscribe and i will see you in the next video